Welcome. My name is Anthony, and this is Era 2 Medieval Legends, a VSD instrument by Eduardo Tarilonte, the guy who brought us libraries like Chevenai, Cantus, and Forest Kingdom. This is a sequel to Era 1, which included 45 medieval instruments, and Era 2 contains all the content of Era 1 and also adds 25 new instruments to the library. Some of the instruments are really unique to this library, never seen in this detail in another library before. The instruments are all very well recorded in different articulations and they capture the spirit of the medieval times perfectly. In this video I want to show you a quick overview about the interface, play some of the instruments from each category and at last building up a whole song using only the ERA 2 VST instrument. So let's start up the sequencer, in my case it's Cubase 8, and I create a new song. The library is based on the Engine 2 VST instrument, so I have to start it now. Let's take a look on the list of the library instruments. They are all sorted by category, like brass, key, percussion, and there are even more categories to choose instruments from. You see here in the string section, the bowed strings, the plucked strings, and also some singing voices, like tavern singers, and a ton of soundscapes. Some of them sounds really awesome. So, before I show you some of the instruments, let's have a look on the interface first. Each instrument has up to three pages. The main page, the control page and the info page. We are on the main page right now. And in the middle, there's the name of the instrument. These are the general controls like volume, pan, pitch and reverb, which can be turned on and off. This for sliders controls the instrument's ADSR. And here you see which articulation is actually played. Now we go on to the control page. The control page contains special controls unique to each instrument and you can assign MIDI controllers via control message or via MIDI learn. On the info page you see a picture of the instrument along with the name and a short description. There's also a list of the recorded articulations represented by the yellow keys on the keyboard and the white keys showing the playable range of the instrument. Before I start to show you some of the instruments, let's have a look on the manual first. The manual contains basic information about the library and the producer. Also, a list of all the instruments sorted by category. This information is similar to page 3 inside the VSD instrument, but you can also get extended information about each instrument. And it's good to have all the information compact on one side of a page as reference for later use. The cool thing about this library is that all recorded loops follow the tempo of the host and some instruments contain green keys with pre-recorded MIDI phrases like rhythm or melodies. You will see this later in this video when I show you the instruments. Okay, let's listen to the instruments.
At last I want to show you how you can compose a song with ERA 2 and in this song I only used ERA 2 instruments and vocals 
from the Era 2 Limited Edition. This vocal package will be available at the second quarter of 2016 as paid upgrade for Era 2 owners. So, for the start, I begin with the hurdy gurdy instrument. Ah, this sounds okay, so I copy it for a few bars. Uh, so at next I need some frame drums. Ah, uh, that sounds really nice. And together with the hurdy gurdy. So what I need now is some tambourines. Basically, the tambourines will follow the rhythm of the frame drums and together it will sound like this. So at next we use some kettle drums and the kettle drums will support the frame drums also to give it a nice groovy feel. Yes, and no medieval music without a crumb horn. Let's bring them all together. Bring up some atmosphere with this Era 2 soundscape adventuring, a guitar-like atmospheric pad. Now bring in the tambourines again. And here comes the bagpipe. Together with his best friend, the two-hold flute. So let's add another rhythmic element, the fiddle groove. And some hand claps. So the next element is a medieval lute. And it plays a nice decent rhythm line. At last we need some singers. So bring in the tavern singers. And now, all together. So now the instrumental is almost finished, but what's still missing are the vocals. In the ERA 2 vocal package, there are two different vocal types. Vocal phrases and legato vocals. Vocal phrases are basically pre-recorded songs term by term. And with legato vocals, you can play the voice like an instrument on the keyboard. Let's start with the phrases first. Dore hondane, dore hondane, te na kere so me ondo ero, tira hendone, tira hendone. Okay, now bring in the instrumental again. So next is the legato vocal, the upper line, the voice is singing, the bottom line, the articulations. (laughs) 
Let's hear it together with the instrumental. So, before I close this video, I want to show you the finished song. In the end, I added the tape recorder, some finalizer and a master EQ. Thanks for watching. I'm Anthony and this is Era 2 Medieval Legends.